Evil clan abducts black kid. Now listen. <laughs> We don't even need to, we don't need to contemplate, we don't need to theorize. This video is racist. <laughs> Let's just be realistic. This video is racist, and there's a high chance the people that made it are low-key racist. There's no way around it, man. God damn it, the thumbnail had chicken wings on it. Why are you gonna put the chicken wings on the damn thumbnail, man? I'm telling you, racist under the guise of teachers, but we gonna watch this video anyway, you're goddamn right, because it's a social experiment, so let's get stuck in. <laughs> Where's your master? No at? way. She sees Miles as Yo! What the f What? Coming up uh, on tomorrow's teachings. <laughs> A gift. Oh, this is the continuation. Monkey, monkey, monkey. Come here, monkey, monkey. Don't talk back to me, monkey thug. Where's your master? No at? way. No. <laughs> nah, these people are racist. I'm telling you. Yeah, what? I know. Where is Miles? I would love to see my grandson. Miles is at school. He should be getting out. Yo. Oh, okay. How is he? He's good. It's going to take him a while to adjust to this new house and lifestyle. Not to pause, but this is the continuation of the one black kid that had the surgery and was uh, transferred into the white body. No. So I'm assuming this is his foster white parent. The, in <sighs> the insanity is beyond my comprehension. That's right. He used to live in Africa in a clay hut. And then what, New York? Yeah, New York. In a tiny apartment with his real dad. And then he just left him. Not the stereotypes. Milk and never came back. Yo! You found him on the street and adopted him. No need to dwell on the past, honey. It's time to start fresh. Nah, she don't have the past. To, hey, this woman does not have the past to use the damn milk stereotype. You do not have the past. We gonna have to. We we gonna have to inspect this individual, man. Outside of this video, I'm guaranteeing it, man. These people are racist. I'm. <laughs> There is no other way. Any non-racist would uh, would not agree to say anything like that on any form of video, man. I'm telling you, <laughs> it has to be. A new life for you and Miles. You're right, Mom. Oh, someone's at the door. Let me call you back. Whoa! Wait, what does it say? To all, to all the monkeys in this neighborhood. Leave or else? Bruh. New to town, Miles wandered through the streets. Wait. Looking for something to do. Wait. Sad and depressed, he feels like no, he doesn't it, fit in. It's not the transferred guy. This is the guy from the previous the video. Yes. Basketball caught his ear. Oh no. Basketball. My favorite. And he felt a familiar pull in his blood. Bro, don't do to join in <laughs> to meet new people. Don't do it. Perhaps find his place in this unfamiliar town. Hey guys, mind if I play? Guys, there's just one. What the heck? What the fuck are you doing here? Miles thought he'd find new friends, but all he found was rejection. That's rough, though. In this neighborhood, it seems no one wants him. Maybe this place would never feel like home. As Miles finally begins to glimpse the bright side, the rhythmic thud of the basketball grounding his thoughts, a white woman steps into view. Oh, shit. Her eyes narrow, catching something off about him. That's a Karen right a there. Unease. That she can't quite place. Wait, is that Karen? She sees Miles as nothing more than a filthy monkey, defiling the pristine white neighborhood park she holds dear. The sight of him ignites a strong hatred within her. Every movement he makes feels like an affront to everything she values. What are you doing here, you thug? Oh my God! No way! How do they keep getting away with this, man? I, I'm telling you, this is genuinely a social experiment for me, man. I have to observe these activities to understand what the internet is willing to let slide, bro. 
This is yo, this is blowing my brains. Just on earth. You should be in a cotton field. Cotton field, man? I think you're confused. Don't talk back to me, monkey thug. Where's your master at? Wow. Hey, you can't talk to me like Yes, I can. Us white people can talk to Negroes any which way we wish, and that's just the way it is. Hey, just go home, lady. That's no way to speak to your higher ups. Yep. Nah, it's time to hey, we turn it up. Let's go. I have fresh meat. Tears streaming. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. You just might have to shoot somebody. Whoa, hey, 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 hey. And GTA, of course. You just might have, you might need the strap, man. You might need the blicky at this point. <laughs> if it's this bad, you just literally might have to become a thug. If they want a thug, they gonna get the goddamn thug at this point in time. You goddamn right. The weight of his loneliness bear down on him heavily. Feeling uncertain and alone, he reaches for the phone and dials his mom's number. Oh, shit. Which mom, though? Is this like his real mother? Call the call goes unanswered, leaving him in silence until a sudden knock echoes from the door. Oh, shit. It's the clan. Miles, confused, assumes it's just the neighborhood kids playing Ding Dong Ditch. But when he opens the door, he stumbles upon something unbelievably disgusting and heartbreaking. A banana? Miles is engulfed in grief. Your mommy's being lynched. You're next. And that's her hair? Correct. What in tarnation is going on, man? I don't know. <laughs> Having just learned that his mother is dead. She dead? Yes. The cruel note confirms her loss, leaving him shattered. Alone in his room, he is consumed by the profound sadness of her absence. Bro, it's time to go. To cope with the pain, he turns to the messages and pictures of his mother, seeking solace in the memories. Is it the lady from the beginning? He loved his mother in a way that was uncommon. Oh, shit! And intense. What the fuck? What? <gasps> Yo! I was wondering why you was giving me the damn stank face. Let me go back to it. Bro gave me a damn stank face, but I wasn't sure why he did that. Like, why are you looking at me like this? Your ass is mine. That is crazy, man. This, bro, who, <laughs> who doing the storyboarding for this damn video, man? I, uh, bro, somebody got issues. Think about this for a second. Somebody wrote this script. Somebody wrote this storyboard. There's a person in this YouTube group that thought this thought. Yeah, so. We're going to put him in a racist scenario, and then he's also going to be infatuated with his mother, and he's going to whack the shit off their pics. Bro, somebody need help, man. Seek help. I wish you could have saw my tree trunk of a wing. What? With guilt and distress after touching himself to a picture of his deceased mother. I need a little thumb stamp. I'm going to go for a walk. Miles decides to go for a walk. He needs Wait, to clear his head. No cleanup? No cleanup. Overwhelming shame and grief. Miles comes across a chicken leg. He loves chicken, but little does he know that something is ain't quite no right way. About this one. Come get your chicken, favorite fried chicken. Come here, monkey. That's a the KKK hey, hey, what has doing? become dangerously what doing? fixated what doing? on the prospect. Ain't no way, bro. Got fish with a chicken leg, man. Nah, at this point, nah, that's on you, bro. That's on you, Heike. Ain't no a. Hey, if it ain't in a box, if that bitch ain't on a plate. I ain't eating it, man. A floating chicken, uh, a chicken drumstick. You gonna pick that shit off the line? Nah, you deserve to get caught, bro. Take him home. We get, do what you gotta do. Put him in a stew, man. You, you, you ain't one of us at this point. Put him in a stew. What are you doing? Whisking him away from the safety. Oh shit! Say so, <laughs> so he's extra dark. What? In a nightmare. He never saw coming. This is crazy, man. Here, no monkeys like bananas. Here you go. Grand Wizard! Please let me go. I didn't do anything wrong, please. Ah. Oh, shit. Bro got the garments on, man. A gift. Wait, why are you doing this? Please don't do this. Silence! 
Sir, should we tar and feather him? What? Wait, oh. this is when the other black guy shows up with the gun, I think. The one that was transferred to a white guy's body. Let's see, though. Too much work. Let's just kill him. One less black in the world is one less black in the world. What about the rope? The rope? I got this. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, let me tell you something. It's people like you that make me sick. Wow. Hey, but why? We all live in this world together. Why can't we all get along? It's people like you that make me sick. Sir. Yo, I feel like this man is so vindicated in this video right now. Like, he get to say that. He didn't say it once. He said that bitch twice, man. He said, listen, I could get away with saying this three times if I want, man. I got free liberty on this damn channel. I could be as racist as I want. <laughs> I guarantee it. These people are vindicated on these videos, man. They're like N-word. I, I almost said the, you know what I'm saying? But they, they just dropped the N-word and they're like, ah, no consequences. <laughs> I hate this shit. What are you babbling about? Have I ever done anything to you? So why kill me just because your leader says so? If, if you ask me, this isn't how God would want. If you ask me, the stop. Got a point. Yeah. Yeah. What? What is it with you two? Stand down. Sir, don't you believe in God? No. He's right. Maybe we should I think about in this. This is acting. Shut up. Wait, 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 You're just wait. letting him get in your head. You believe in Hitler? But even Hitler knew that he couldn't fight everyone. No, I won't let you do this. Too. No, I've had enough. Nah, the, the acting went from bad to, is this a beta? Like, I think this video in beta still. They, they didn't patch it completely yet. The release date ain't, this is like the damn, what do they call it? Um, This is early access. This is like the beta portion of the video. Still got some patchwork to be done. That voice acting is atrocious. Me too. You can't win if your own people are turning against you. Look around. Not all of them agree with you. If you kill me, you'll just be proving that you don't care about them either. You've gone that too far. This isn't what we signed some up good for. Stuff. Oh, for crying out loud, who does this kid think he is? Oh, for crying out loud, who does this thing kid think he is, Malcolm X? Malcolm X? Enough, all of you, stand down. Think about it. Do you do you guys really want to die here today? Because if you keep following, that's where it's going. Oh, you got something? Y'all smart enough. That killing someone who hasn't done anything to you isn't gonna solve anything. We gotta kill him. Karen wanted a Mexican. We can't keep this one. They working for Karen? What? Can't let you do this. What the fuck? Get out of my way, you fool. Miles hey. narrowly escaped the deadly situation thanks to the intervention of a mysterious figure who was secretly working undercover within the KKK. Meanwhile, the Grand Wizard eager to recruit more Mexicans to fuel Karen's hatred and bolster the KKK's ranks, remains unaware that Miles is preparing to infiltrate their organization. What? Miles is determined to help bring down the KKK and avenge the injustices inflicted. This is a whole damn world. universe. This is Omari from tomorrow's teachings. Hope you guys learned something. Omari. Remember that treat everyone same no matter what this can amari i don't i don't know what it, you you need to get out of this channel amari on my name listen this is a whole damn story plot line man there's an overarching plot this man trying to take down the kkk by himself now the question is the way he said k kk is it like the karen something clan because my nigga we got i need to figure out first who karen is and what she got going on i feel like once i watch karen's plot line i'll understand where this channel is going I don't know if I'm supposed to be learning something or if this is one big multiverse, man. But whatever it is, y'all need to chill the hell out, man. Y'all getting away with some murder on this goddamn channel. I and There is no no evidence you could provide to me that'll convince me that y'all ain't racist. Even Amari racist, goddamn it. <laughs> Every single one of y'all. Nothing could convince me, man. Who agrees to do this kind of shit? No, no rightful human being, man. But all in all very interesting video the social experiment continues so we're gonna see what else they got to push out but until then i'll see y'all for the next video man i need to mentally heal from all this toxic energy to my brain i'm out <laughs>